just had to show her right in that, man. Wow. What's going on? It's the kid for War Fabian, Big Boss Fabo. I'm back with a home free reaction and I'm super late. I know y'all, Home Free Traveling Soldier premiered May 28, 2021. Thank you to all those in service, the families and friends of those in the service and all who appreciate the sacrifice of our men and women in uniform. Make every day to preserve our freedom. But as y'all know, Memorial Day had just passed, right? Uh, not too long ago, so I'm sure this was, um, you know, an ode to that. You know, fallen soldiers, exact, you know, all that. I got two brothers in the military. Shout out to them, man. Respect to them. Um, and I just reacted to Land of the Free, and I feel like both of those are, you know, in sync. This one's sal saluting, uh, you know, our soldiers, fallen soldiers. Land of the Free is showing appreciation for the, the country. So very patriotic, very patriotic, man. Let me know y'all's thoughts. Uh, you know, the, the visuals as well as the music Home Free's been releasing because, man, Land of the Free, man, that was a banger. I thoroughly enjoyed the song and the video. And it's funny how, like, they're able to have such, like, these organic kind of videos, but they still excite me. Because they've done a video, you know, out in the wilderness or out in a, on, on some land, out, out on a farm, like, you know, whatever, man. Just a lot of visual landscaping, you know what I'm saying, to add into the cinematography. So it's like, I honestly like that about their visuals, but Land of the Free wasn't something that was new to me, but... I don't know. I just can't get enough home free, I guess. And I don't know why it took me so long to react. My apologies. But without further ado, let's get into this home free traveling soldier. Two days past 18, she was waiting for the bus in her army green. Sat down in a booth in a cafe nearby. Gave her order to a guy in a thin black tie. She's a little shy, so we gave her a smile. And she said, would you mind sitting down for a while and talking to me? I'm feeling a little low. He said, I'm off in an hour and I know where we can go. So they went down and they sat on the pier Said I bet you got a girlfriend but I don't care I got no one to send a letter to Would you mind if I send one back here to you? I wonder why it's only chance uh, Austin and Rob in this one. If y'all have some additional insight to why that is, obviously I can actually hear the others in the background. I just heard um, background vocals from Tim, so I don't know what I'm even saying. But why are they not pictured within the visual? Was that Tim? I think I did hear him in the background there. But anyways, already getting a sense of what the story's about. You know what I'm saying? Um, they're, they're, they're definitely painting a thorough picture here. So let's hop back in and see how the story ends. Alone when the letter says the soldier's coming home. So the letters came once a week oh, here, here the guys. from Oklahoma within the Middle East. And she told him of her heart. It might be love and all of the things she was so scared of. She said when it's getting kind of rough over. Honestly, I was lost because I, I thought the dude was going to get deployed. I thought they were speaking from his perspective, but I was completely off. That day sitting down at the pier and I close my eyes and see your handsome smile. Don't worry, but I won't be able to write for a Traveling soldier, our love will never end. Waiting for the soldier to come back 
I can already feel sadness and emotion. But this is dope, you know? I like how they're storytelling here. Seems like they're in some type of sound stage here because you see the props, you see a lot of the stage production that seems very simple, right? But you're still getting a sense of the story. Like she was, I like how they had the tent, you know, her, her, her equipment, her bag, and she was like, reading the letter under the flashlight you know what i'm saying like and i guess he's working you know just living while maintaining the communication you know with someone that he sees potential in. pretty interesting you know i'm sure a lot of folks can relate to a story like this a lot of folks you know go through this um couples etc who have significant others that are overseas deployed or whatever man my heart goes out to you guys because i know that ain't easy you know what i'm saying but Definitely salute to you guys because y'all are strong individuals, right? Those in individuals who sustain during that are very strong individuals. Um, that, that definitely hold, you know, the pieces to the family together. If they're mothers that are, you know, um, or fathers that are, you know, watching over the kids while the other one, the significant other is deployed. You know what I mean? So prayers out to the families, all the best and everything going on and all the soldiers coming back home. You know what I mean? Like, in the anthem sang a man said folks would you bow your head for the list of the local army dead crying all alone under the sands was a piccolo player in the marching band and one name read and nobody really cried but a single guy in a thin black I'm understanding the story correctly, right? Because I don't want no surprise, crazy ending going on right here, and I was completely wrong. But that's 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 definitely unfortunate to meet someone that you see potential in, and it's just taken away like that, man. Um, and I'm sure a lot of individuals can relate to a story like this as well. You know, not even it just being related to having a potential or someone that's in the military or a traveling soldier, so to speak people that you actually meet you know in any day-to-day -day that you start a relationship with and you know something unfortunate happens to them or you know it's just it's sad man it's sad Soldiers coming home. Mm. I just had to show her writing that, man. Wow. Yeah, that's tough. It's got to be tough, man. Someone you love, you know, in general. You know, when uh, my brothers joined the military initially, I was young, man. I was still in high school. They joined the Air Force, you know what I'm saying? And of course they went to, you know, training camp, did some like tours, you know, Middle East, whatever. Spent a lot of times overseas in general, man. So I can understand, I can relate, you know, because a lot of times like my family been separated, you know what I'm saying? I was, it's never everyone together. So heart goes out because, you know, I don't see my brothers often, you know, the line of work is due to their line of work, you know what I'm saying? But I definitely respect what they do, salute. Um, to all of our service members, man. Not even just military, man. Police, firefighters, everybody who risked their life, EMT, whatever, that risked their life or do something day to day that like, you know, obviously to protect and serve. Let's put it that way, to serve, you know what I'm saying? So let me know, man.
Peace, love, prosperity. I, lo I love that one. I love both of the home free reactions I did today. Two of the both of the new releases they have, man. So let me know y'all thoughts in the comment section below. We'll catch you guys next time, man. Peace out.